lovely people. <laughs> You've got some scrap. You've been out. I've been out with a barra. No, I ain't really been out with a barra. Look at this little lot though. Check these bits out, guys. That's control paranol. Ariston, that's a boiler, but I didn't know Ariston made boilers. There you go. Bit of circuit board and a few bits of cable. We've got some awesome stuff, guys. We've got a net gear modem. Check this out, look. Wowzers. Nice pot. Extension wheel. Pull up there. We got some shower bits, and I think that's some sort of steamer, right? Because that goes on top of that pot. Electro jam, and then we got one of these pumps, like a dispenser pump, I think. Got like hand soap. I'm not sure. Aircon pump, maybe? High flow tank, there you go. Bit of Auntie Mabel, the funny old plug. And we got this, the sky box. Love it. Whole box of goodies, look at this, look. And there's some antique stuff in it. I love this sort of shit, look. Both parts have just been put together upside down. Yeah, I'll one for you young'uns. A cassette, a Maxwell cassette. Look at that, it's a C90. Whoop. <laughs> and there's a battery operated Dremel. How cool is that? Don't work. Hmm. Hitachi battery charger. Whole box of goodies, look. We've got some right old antiques as well, guys. So, full up with bits like this, yeah? The old circuit breakers. We all know what's inside those. Nice bit of silver. Bit of silver plated cake basket. Might be able to get a nice plate to put in there. Dusty would like that. I'll get a plate to fit in there, I wonder if she want that. It's quite sweet. There yeah, mate. We'll be able to do something with that. Yeah, it's a whole box of goodies. And the best bit. Oh, what's the best bit? It's all good. <laughs> Compressor hose and a gun, right? That gun could be full of paint and absolutely tossed, but compressor hose is all right. So then we got this, and I don't even know what that is. Some sort of aviation thingy. Space Age Electronics. Wow, it looks like a Speedo anchor watch. I don't know. Does it go in the boat? It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's not all scrap, is it? Some bits are just interesting. That's a housing. That's scrap. It's a bit of scrap iron. Extension wheel. So that's all more Auntie Mabel. We like Auntie Mabel. And then we got... What's that, a capacitor? It's pretty old, look at that. Yeah, caught me thumb, finger, didn't I? Look. Ah. Oh. And that was off of this bleeding thing. I stuck it in there, look, you see all these sharp bits at the bottom? And that ripped my hand open. So I shan't put my hand in there again. And that's all nice and rounded, that bit, so I'll hold it there, look. Just dump this up here. Oh! Ah, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> ah, yeah, flipping lunatic. Like me barrel. Woo! Alright, I'm just going to put you down for two seconds. Alright? You can watch. Keep an eye on that bit for a second. 
Oh! What's going on? Something's working. Hey! Sweet! It works. Alright, let's try you again. Pop you there. Just while I pick this barrel back up. Yes, in you go. Need greedy boards. Need some greedy boards for me barrel. <laughs> Day. Hey look guys, another housing. Focus in please. No? Hello? Hello phone? There you go. Little electric motor. That is quite old so that's going to be copper in there. Let's get some weight at the back there. Look at this. What's that, a 40 channel CB? Yeah, breaker, breaker. You got your ears on there, good buddy? <laughs> that was out of a boat for sure, look. It's even got a nice bit of timber. I wanna know what that is. If anyone knows, let me know. Drop a comment. Hey, look, we know it's out of a boat. Yeah, boy. Don't know why I picked that up, but um, it's a boy, <laughs> like you do. <sighs> and that, I don't know. Is that some sort of um, internal shower unit? Could be. Plug it in, see if it works. Right. Stick the boy at the front because it's nice and light. Need to get some weight at the back here, that's why I tipped up, as well as that plug dragged it over. And then we got some more aluminum and stainless. On your hands down, stuff sharp. Where well, there's a wheel, there's a way. Oh, I don't know what that is, look. Electrogen. Whoa. I think that's for lasers or something. Wow, oh, look. It's got that on it. Remote there with civil control. What is it? Beep, 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 beep. I don't know. It's got a normal household plug on there. Don't know what that is. Looks like PTO driven, that. It's another steamer in it, for sure. That'll go on there. Oh yeah, because look, it's got a bottle with fluid in. To avoid injury, hot steam. Ah, oh, there you go, look, steamer. Another bit of Auntie Mabel, or Parker Schnabel. Look, what is that, an amplifier? Jeez, guys. Onkyo. <laughs> Onkyo. I think that should be the new name of um, Lee's Anfield in the Lofts uh, three legged donkey. Onkyo. Halloui <laughs> Omium. Genesis. Or Genesis. Who knows? I like that though. I like this big dial in the front. Boom. Oh, it's not actually travelling far. Muting. Uh, integrated amplifier, there you go. Thought it was an amplifier. Anyway, we've even got some tricks in there, look. Floor polisher. We got um, an actual old radio, which I'm going to have a look in a minute, and big bag of antique stamps. All sorts of stuff in there. And um, I can't show you this. Hold on. Uh, <laughs> the lady, she loves a milk tray. <laughs> There's loads of it. Oh dear. Look at some of these old Christmas cards, look. 
Wow. Look at that. Jeez, guys. They were awesome. I know there's collectors out there for this sort of stuff. Anyway, that's in the back of the car. And we've got another big bag down there. And a whopping great leisure battery. Woohoo! Anyway, right, I'm going to go and get some of this out and we'll go through that bag together, yeah? See you in a bit. <laughs> so, guys, we made it back. Oh, it's a long garden, you know. So let's shift this bike, because that's, that's an alley bike, that is. And that was going to be stripped. Let's clear the workbench. How this lot is going to cope in undone, I do not know. I can't even remember what's inside these bags. Oh look, we even got a house plant that someone didn't want. But uh, it's looking a little worse for wear. But I will give it a loving home. As you all know, oh, you lost it. I like my house plants. I like my plants in the garden too. Right, it's a bit wibbly wobbly. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, this whole radio look. Check that out. It's got a bit of the P missing off a special. Look at them radio stations. I thought it was going to be an imitation, but it is the real deal. There you go. You can't really see the valves in there, can you? Huh? Skip along. Oh, there's one. Yay, look at that. And this one's a bit bigger, so we might have to scout up to look at that one. And... There it is. Look at that, guys. That's awesome, yeah? It's the real deal. She's the real deal. Nice old stereo. Yeah, so that was... I can't remember what was in here. I think this was old books. Or vintage toys. So we've got a nice old radio, we'll try and take care of. Look at some of these, look. It's just full. Real to real tape. What is that? It takes a light bulb, yeah? I wouldn't know what that is. Before I destroy stuff like this, I always like to find out what it is. Uh, look at these toys now. Is that the remote control? <sighs> no, it's not, but look at that. Oh, jeez, guys. It's an E-type Jag. Wow. <laughs> With the remote. I bet there's no batteries in that. No. These are coming spare tyres for burning out. <laughs> that is awesome. What do you reckon the date is on that? Made in Hong Kong? I shouldn't have done that, should I? No disrespect to the Hong Kong people at all. I'm sorry for doing that. I'm sorry. That's awesome. E type Jag. <sighs> no date. What do you reckon, guys? It's made in Hong Kong. Hong Kong stuff is normally a bit like um, stuff made in Japan. Japanese stuff is uh, normally really good quality. Ski. That's a razor, isn't it? Yeah, look at that. I'm usually find this stuff in boxes. This all came out of one skip. It's a musical Monica. Hello, Monica. Wow. Look at that, London's burning. Oh, London, London Bridge. London Bridge is falling down. 
row, row, row your boat. Mary had a little lamb. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. Oh, I wonder what the, there's a red one. Look at this stuff here. Beware of the dog. <laughs> Christmas card. Of peace and goodwill. Ah, oh, there's a good dog of wog. <laughs> what is that? That's his big leg. <laughs> books. I wonder what this one is in. That's one that plays different tunes. No, nope, same tunes. That's brilliant. Look at that, we only got two of them, didn't we? And there is tons of stuff in here. Packets of seeds. Monopoly money. That's proper old school stuff, that. Really thick. Books. Right, I'm going to have to go through this stuff um, carefully, guys. That's not so old. Travel card. Whereabouts is that? London Transport. Looks like the old pound note, then, colours. 21 quid for a month, look. Wow. But that takes a lot of people back. You wouldn't get that now. What is it, about three grand a month now? Isn't it? Some awesome little books. Royal Marines Association. Wow. Membership book. Loads of stuff, loads and loads and loads of stuff. Look at that. That would have been silver plated in its time. That looks Indian to me. I wonder, I wonder. I wonder what that is on there, look. Ah, they're actual images. I'll have to have a look. There we go. EPNS, isn't it? Yep, electropated nickel silver. Oh, oh, can't show you that. Hang on. How bizarre. <laughs> That's hilarious. All right. <laughs> Look at it all. Poor little barrow. <laughs> the lawnmower was on the drive when I got in. Right, we're gonna have to go through this slowly, guys. I'll see you in a minute. So there we go, guys. Check that out, look. Is that Ali? In Bogner Regis? <laughs> Got loads of stuff from that skip. Look at all these Christmas cards. Look at the colours. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, a couple of decks of playing cards. Got to count to see if they're there, otherwise they might end up in the bin. Boomerang from Australia. Proper old painting. I ain't too sure about that, but that's, I'll check everything out. But um, all these little books, ration books, all that sort of stuff. Some awesome little tins. Cigarette tins. Uh, there's a rolling machine tin. Look at that, look. A lot of electroplated nickel silver. There's a little bit of uh, pewter. Those toys that you saw before. Um, another little cigarette tin plug a rake of books there's some real interesting stuff there i would really like that that's a cruiser mac that is that i can't show you i think you could probably guess what that lot is a stack there <laughs> bunch of stamps i've got to go through this porsche which is i did see a date on there uh there you go 19, 1986. Wow, that's old, man. That's old. Ain't quite as old as me, though. Yeah, got an awesome little book. I like these little books. Even if I don't like the contents, I just collect them because I do like the little book. Yeah. How can you not like that anyway? Coloured plates. Hey, it's another one for Dusty. Or is it just a storybook? 
Yeah, there ain't no coloured plates in there, so perhaps it's uh, means something else, if you know what I mean. If you know what I mean, it means something else. Yeah, there's maps. There's all sorts of books in there. If you want to show, if you want me to show you those, I will. Just let me know. A couple of little bits of china. That is a um, capacitor, I think, in a sealed box. That's an old radio, which was um, it's got the valve in the back. That is another saucy one I can't show you. A couple of decks of cards, a couple of pens. I like to find these. Them old brass darts, and that's what that orange maroon, not orange, that maroon packet is at the back there. It's got a skull and crossbone um, set of darts in there. It's pretty awesome. Oh, there goes the truck. No watch, but a watch strap. And this little thing I'm lucky to find intact. If someone could tell me what this actually is. I've looked at it closely and it's not moulded. That's actually carved. And it's either bone or ivory. And to find it intact with that tip is crazy, man. What would that have been used for? Anyway, what else did we get in this box of tricks? Another pen. That's the fountain pen. We've got the lid for that somewhere. This you saw on Bear Hardcore Pickers a little while ago. And I did let him know in the, the video comments that I had one that was tiny. And somebody told me it was used for uh, wartime maps, miniature maps. But he's got another one just slightly bigger and it's for counting threads in carpet. So you put that on there on top of the, the bit of material and you count the threads per square inch. But that ain't per square inch, is it? No. So I don't know. Half penny. Pound coin. It looks like 1980s. 1990. That is um, 1956. And we found a penny. There it is. Look, that's the lid to that fountain pen. You find a decent lid right put it in your pocket because you know damn well you're going to find a pin, pen eventually now these I've come across these loads of times right anyone know what it is is it a mobile car coaster you're putting your cap on it hairband bracelet what I don't know and we've got the George V penny which was 1931 all those Christmas cards and that postcard and uh, we got this one look British and Foreign Bible Society it's the Holy Bible alright just to go look look at the date and that's not first published that's, that's the date it was issued not 1837 it's nearly 200 years old there you go, it's been signed at the top, 1839. So it was on the shelf for a couple of years or in someone's possession. Does that say it's a mother's, mother's day? Uh, anyway, it's an awesome book. How can that go in a skip? I wouldn't better throw that in a skip. I'm gonna have to find a home for that. Don't matter if I'm religious or not. So, there we go guys, some trinkets. Anyone know what that is? Is that, um, it's a tie pin, isn't it? Tie pin? Caught my bloody finger, didn't I? Look. Donut. I'm sure that's a tie pin. I'm sure I've seen those chains hanging down before. I don't think it went that way. It went that way, didn't it? Yep. There you go, and that'll clip to the shirt. Was it the chain around the front? I can't remember now. I don't know, I'm sure it's a tie pin anyway. So, that's that little lot. That's that little lot. Now let's go unpack this. Oh, look how blue it went. Yeah, see you back in a bit. Too much to do. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy.